What's up guys, Razor Reviews here, and today we have a new review on the Razor Mercenary Backpack. Now I'm really excited, uh, just to tell you about the unboxing experience, it wasn't like any other Razor products, like it was really good. Uh, it was pretty much just a brown shipping box inside a plastic bag, so I didn't, I didn't think I should unbox it because it wasn't that great. But, I'll just run you through right now. It has a nice little green razor logo right here. It's like made out of, I don't know, some rubberized stuff. And it has these loops right here, which I don't know what you would do with. Then it has these nice, uh, like, pouches on the side. These are really nice. Uh, the whole thing is uh, waterproof. Exterior waterproof, not interior, but... Exterior waterproof, so if you like uh, splash some water on it, you're gonna be okay. Then, it, then you can open this little flap up right here. There's a little buckle. You can open that flap up, and then you have where your initial bag stuff goes. Uh, you have two little mesh mesh pockets right here. And then you have these uh, these little things right here. These are just little pouches, they're on each side. Uh, so if you open these up, uh, I put pencils in mine, green and black, of course, but they're not that big, as you can see. Uh, I don't know what else you could fit in there, but that's what I put in there. So that's that, and then you open up the main thing. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this, but it has a really nice really really nice interior if you can see it's like it's rubberized something in here it is really really padded so I'll just run you what's inside of here it has a really deep pocket to the end I don't know if you can see down there and then it just has a laptop a little section where you can stick your laptop this is specialized for a a razor blade 14 but it says that it should be able to fit any 15 inch uh, laptop anyways that's a run through the brag um, and now my thoughts on it well actually I should show you the other side um, so it has this little thing that connects here so connects there it has some really nice padding right there and down here uh, and then it also has this uh, waist thing I actually put it on right now but it has like a little waist thing to keep the to keep the what is it the weight off your shoulders so like I haven't tightened these up but you tighten those up and then it hugs your weight so you can uh, not as much weight is on your shoulders, but I'm just showing what it looks like on your body. I don't know if you can see that, so I'll squat down. And that's what it looks like. Now, build quality is definitely something to talk about. Um, build quality is definitely a big thing in Razor's products, and this, this is the most hefty, robust backpack I've ever seen. Uh, it is military grade, so stuff like that is awesome. And then also, oh, that's pretty cool. Um, also, I did tell you it was waterproof. That is true. Um, and also, throwing this aside, I also got this little carabiner pouch with it, which, uh, they had like a code for it that you got it for free with the backpack so this is what that looks like it's not a big thing it's just that and then the inside uh, with a tiny razor logo I think they should have stick the razor logo right here but whatever a carabine right here like a small one so you, so you can like stick it onto your pants something like that so it looks like that, so you can hold like, stuff.
stuff in it. Anyways, I thought that was just pretty cool that they just added that for free. Anyways, uh, I also will be making uh, more reviews on Razor stuff. I have a Razor Man of War coming. And that is the reason why I haven't been really making videos. Also, the start of school, and that's why I got that new backpack. Um, so, sorry guys, I haven't been making videos, but uh, I will be starting right as I get my uh, new Man of War headset. Because then I'll have a really good microphone on that headset. So then I can start doing, like, we, we can stop using the camera and pointing it at the screen. So, that'll be really good. So, also, I'll leave a link down in the description to my Facebook page, uh, Razor Reviews, and my email. You can find me at RazorReviews05 at gmail.com. So, if you give me some feedback, or uh, actually, please, please make some requests for some videos, because I actually have, like, no ideas right now. So, if you can make some requests for some videos, that would be really great. And don't forget to subscribe. It will really help me boost my self-esteem, maybe. And I'll see you guys later.